the Sweetwater Fire Department responding to an early morning fire, and when the Sweetwater Fire Department arrived at the house in the 2400 block of Bristol Drive this morning, they saw flames coming out of two front windows and the front door. KRBC's Kelsey Pittman shows us how fast the community is coming together to help this family in need. Early Wednesday morning, sirens saw a lot of people running around but really wasn't sure what was going on. A family of nine lost everything in a fire in Sweetwater. The young men that were in the house, they were like, we knew we just had to get out of the house. Sweetwater Fire Chief Grant Madden saying, even though they were just asleep, it seemed like they had a plan. I believe they broke out a window and, and some of them came out of a window. Um, but they all got out of the house. They all got out and they were all in the front yard, cold, barefooted, sleep in their eyes. While only seven were home. There were no injuries, uh, but they did lose pretty much everything they own. Initial results show that it was electrical and started in the kitchen, but the investigation is still ongoing. We do know that they were having electrical problems yesterday. Already getting the help they need from friends and family. That they were staying with family, but Trinity Baptist Church has agreed to be a drop off point for donations donations for the family as well as the community. One neighbor already looking at what she can give. We're blessed to live in Sweetwater. When something goes wrong, basically all the community will come out and help. They just need to reach out and let us know who they are. In Sweetwater, Kelsey Pittman, KRBC, Abilene's Local News. All right, thanks Kelsey for sizing and what the family needs right now. Go to our website, thecountryhomepage.com.